what factors affect your sleep, and how does tinnitus affect your sleep? While there are many different factors that can affect our ability to sleep, there are things that we can do to help us sleep better. As I'm sure you already know, it's important to avoid napping. Even if you're tired from not getting a good night's sleep the night before, don't nap. In addition, you should exercise regularly. However, you don't want to exercise right before going to bed. Try to exercise at least three to four hours before going to sleep. We don't want your body to be too warm when trying to sleep. Let the room be as dark as possible. It should be cool, but not freezing. Teach your body to associate bed with sleep. So don't watch TV in bed, don't scroll on your phone. If you bathe or shower before bed, don't let the water temperature be too hot. Again, we want our body temperature to be cool. If you like taking a hot bath at night, do that at least two hours before bed. Stop taking anything with caffeine at least six hours before bedtime. In addition, try not to smoke, drink alcohol, or eat too close to bedtime. Use sound in the bedroom. If the room is quiet, your tinnitus can be more bothersome. If you can't fall asleep in the first 15 to 20 minutes, get up and do something. Maybe clean the kitchen or do some relaxation exercises and try again. These are all things that you can do to help yourself sleep better at night.